In America, Jeeps sell like hot cakes. Over here, they've had a pretty good run of it too since they were launched back in 1993. This is a four litre Cherokee. It's the smaller of the two Jeeps. And as you can see, it still gets a good deal of boot space. Plenty of space back there. One of the main criticisms of the Jeep though was getting in and out of the rear because of the, the footwell in and in there. And as you can see, it's a little bit tight here in the back and it's just not very comfortable getting in and out of it. However, that has been rectified on the new Jeeps which are about to be launched into the UK. If you wanted to buy this car when it was new, it would have set you back somewhere around 22, 23,000 pounds. But now after four years, well, it's depreciated somewhat because you could buy this for about nine and a half thousand pounds. I've always really liked the Jeep Cherokee and it's been around quite a few years in the UK. Make sure that you go for a right-hand drive cars before they were first introduced in the UK officially. There are quite a few left-hand drive vehicles about which may be cheap but I don't think are worth the money to be perfectly honest. You get selectable four-wheel drive. You can have it in just two-wheel drive for part of the time or shift it to part-time four-wheel drive, full-time four-wheel drive and then shift it to the low ratio box as well for when you get on that real rough stuff. The Cherokees drive actually very well. There's not too much body roll going around corners, although the steering is a bit too light for my liking, to be honest. It tends to wander when you're going in a straight line and you're always having to correct it slightly. It's worth looking out for one or two of these special edition models from the Cherokee range. Things like the Stealth, which was in black and had lots of spoilers and blackened windows. Those are fairly rare cars to find. And also the Orvis, again, with a few extra bits and bobs which added to the price range. But now you can pick them up for quite reasonable money. I've always liked the Jeeps ever since they were launched in the UK. Although they have a boxy, dated look both inside and out, there's something desirable about the Cherokee. The all-new Jeep Cherokee, out soon, will affect prices of these cars even more. So, haggle hard for a bargain. I'm a big fan of Jeeps. I really like these Cherokees, and I reckon that this car for £9,500 is a bit of a bargain. But you don't have to pay as much as that to get a good Cherokee. £5,000 will get you a really nice early K-Reg example. That's all for part one of Used Car Heaven. In part two, we're driving some Rovers. <laughs>